What's up, guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my DFS picks for NFL Week 4 Thursday Night Football. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. Okay, in this video, I'm going to give you my top DFS picks for this Thursday night football showdown between the Green Bay Packers and the Philadelphia Eagles. And if you stay to the very end after all my picks and after I show you the draft dashboard tools, I'll give you my super secret sleeper pick that no one's talking about. Okay, my Thursday night football showdown quarterback is Aaron Rodgers from the Green Bay Packers playing the Philadelphia Eagles who have the 8th worst defense overall and give up the ninth most fantasy points to opposing quarterbacks. Aaron Rodgers hasn't been great so far this season. He's only averaging 14 fantasy points per game. He only scored 13 fantasy points last game. He's only rushing the ball around two times a game. He's gonna be about 74% owned tonight, but I think he's the quarterback to own tonight. He's projected at 19.2 fantasy points here in week four. Aaron Rodgers loves to perform on national television. This is a home game, favorable matchup, and I think tonight he's gonna have a breakout game. So I like Aaron Rodgers here versus the Philadelphia Eagles. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you want to enter the drawing for $100 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $100 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday and announce them in our video. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. Okay, my Thursday Night Football Showdown running back it's gonna be Miles Sanders from the Philadelphia Eagles playing the Green Bay Packers, who've got a good defense overall, but they give up the third most fantasy points to opposing running backs. Miles Sanders scored 14 fantasy points last week. He had 13 rush attempts and four pass targets. He's averaging about 15 touches a game between rush attempts and pass targets. You're gonna save a ton of salary on Miles Sanders on DraftKings. He's almost 3,000 less than Aaron Jones, and he could match Aaron Jones' fantasy production. He's on the field for 42% of the snaps. He's touched the ball 45% of that time. He's projected at 10.2 fantasy points here in week four. He's only gonna be about 19% owned, so that's pretty low ownership for a running back. Last week was his first double-digit fantasy point week, so not a lot of people are gonna be playing Miles Sanders. I think this is a good spot to differentiate your lineup, and I think he gets plenty of work here tonight with their wide receivers still hurting a little bit. So I like Miles Sanders here versus the Green Bay Packers. Okay, my Thursday night football showdown wide receiver is Marquez Valdez Scantling, MVS, for the Green Bay Packers playing the Philadelphia Eagles who have the six worst defense overall, and they give up the third most fantasy points to opposing wide receivers. Valdez Scantling has scored 12 fantasy points per game. He scored 22 fantasy points last game off of 10 pass targets. He's averaging seven pass targets per game, plenty involved in this offense. He's on the field for 81% of the snaps, and he touches the ball about 14% of the time. And you're gonna save a lot of salary with Valdez Scantling. He's projected at 12.9 fantasy points here tonight. It's a home game, great matchup. He's gonna be about 45% owned. I'm looking for him to build off of a good week last week. So I like Marquez Valdez Scantling here versus the Philadelphia Eagles. Real quick guys, I got great news. For a limited time, we're offering a full 30 day trial to Draft Dashboard. You can try all the tools for NFL, MLB is still going, NBA is right around the corner. This is a great time to get in and try everything for one month. The tools are all about saving research time. You can see the last three games, the fantasy points per game, the targets they got per game, so you can see how involved they are in the offense, the rushes they got per game. Seeing all this stuff on one screen helps you save time and make better picks. Oh, and if you're tired of doing research every day, we just added a cheat sheet that shows hand-picked plays for the slate. No confusing stat lines, no headaches, 
just a simple cheat sheet that shows the absolute best players for your lineups. Okay, my Thursday Night Football showdown tight end is Zach Ertz from the Philadelphia Eagles playing the Green Bay Packers who have a great defense overall and they've given up the fewest fantasy points to opposing tight ends. So that's a little bit concerning, but Zach Ertz has scored 12.7 fantasy points per game on the season. He's getting an average of 10 pass targets per game. He's on the field for 94% of the snaps and he touches the ball 14% of that time. He scored 10 fantasy points last week off of seven targets. He had 16 targets the game before that. So this guy's got huge usage and the chance to be a target monster every single week. He's projected at 14.6 fantasy points here tonight. You're gonna have to pay up for Zach Ertz, but he could be the highest scorer on the slate. He's gonna be about 55% owned, and the only other tight end that's really playable is on the other side, Jimmy Graham, who scored zero fantasy points the last two weeks, although I think he was a little banged up, and I don't mind going to Jimmy Graham if you need to save the salary, and you want to get a little risky with some lower ownership. But Zach Ertz is by far the best tight end on the slate tonight. He should get a ton of targets tonight as Alshon Jeffrey is just getting back from injury and Deshaun Jackson remains out with that abdominal strain. So I like Zach Ertz here versus the Philadelphia Eagles. If you want to try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video. You've unlocked the bonus content. My super secret sleeper pick for this NFL Thursday night showdown is Mac Hollins from the Philadelphia Eagles playing the Green Bay Packers. So we know the Packers have a good defense, but Mac Collins is super low salary and he scored 10 fantasy points in the last two weeks off of seven and eight targets. He's only gonna be about 15% owned. He's on the field for 66% of the snaps and he's touched the ball 10% of that time. So he's getting more work here with some injuries at the wide receiver position. He's projected at 5.2 fantasy points here tonight. He's only 2,400 DraftKings salary. So that's gonna open up your salary at the other positions. And you'll be super happy with 10 fantasy points from this guy. So I like Mac Hollins here versus the Green Bay Packers. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, please smiggity smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Oh, and please comment below with your favorite player for this NFL slate. I love to hear what you guys have to think. Thanks again and good luck. Do you want more DFS picks for NFL week four? Check out the video linked right in the middle of the screen. Tap that video to continue getting our week four DFS picks.